Customer Portal Solution, Portal Users View. So we are in our inbox and we can see a confirmation email with a link in it. It says please click here, as simple as it sounds, but uh, this email is fully adjustable. So we proceed with the link and we get to our Customer Portal Users page. And the coolest thing here is user details section where we can actually see how our solution looks for a customer portal user. So the page is loaded and these fields here are actually fields retrieved by Drupal from Sugar CRM accounts module. So some of the fields are read only and some of the fields are available for us to edit. And for example, we're gonna edit this phone number. So first of all, we check with our uh, Sugar Serum corresponding account, and uh, the, the number is here, and we change it in customer portal form. And as we save our changes, the information is going to be updated in Sugar CRM as well. So we wait for page to reload. And then we're gonna check with Sugar. Okay, done. Uh, the number is updated here and we go to the corresponding account in Sugar CRM. We reload the page here. And here it is. The number is updated here as well. So now, these handy tables here are generated by Drupal from Sugar CRM related modules. In this case, these are contacts and opportunities, and we can actually do the same things here by opening a contact and editing it, and uh, all the changes we do are going to be updated in Sugar CRM as well. Now, for every action, taken by a customer portal user, Sugar CRM administrator can set up a notification. Now here are the INET Docs integration modules and we can a um, couple of files available for us to download or edit or delete and we have a dedicated folder here as well. So we go to this folder and here we will try to download a file from this folder. So let's try this one. So we save this file to our hard disk and we go back and now we're gonna upload a file to our dedicated folder. So we go, this time we go for edit and we click attach new file here and we choose a file to upload. Here it is and we open a file and click on save. Now we go back to our customer portal users page and we open our dedicated folder once again and we can see our file successfully uploaded here. So we go back and this is it. This is how our solution looks for a customer portal user.